She has left behind family and friends in Greece. Now Despina Panagiotopoulou wants to make a new start in Germany. For the past few weeks, she's been taking part in a language scholarship in Frankfurt. A visit to the employment office is part of the program. In her home country, she presently has little chance of finding work as a mathematician. The 23-year-old spent the past year sending out job applications without success. No reply. Not even an email. Nothing. I don't know. <laughs> now she's getting advice on how to apply properly in German. You should avoid cliched formulas like, I read your job posting with great interest. And then the right job will hopefully come along. She's got a degree but can't find work. And here in Germany we can't find people to fill our jobs. And that's ideal. It gives people like her a chance to develop. Of course, we can't address our entire shortage of skilled workers with one or even 18 people, but it's a first step. The Metzler Foundation has brought 17 young people to Germany. They come from Greece, Portugal, Spain and Italy. They know a little German. After four months of intensive language courses at the Goethe Institute, the young graduates will be ready for the German labor market. I can make my room nicer by painting the walls. They are engineers, computer scientists and biochemists, and all well educated. Now they'll finally get the chance to work in their fields. Portuguese companies always want experience, but we don't have any, and no one will give us that experience. I said, OK, I'll try Germany, because Germany also has many companies. I'm learning German so I can have more opportunities to find a job. My dream is to work here, to have a career, and perhaps raise a family here. <laughs> but the first step is to find your way in a foreign country. And that includes more than good German. How do you open a bank account? How do you find an apartment? To answer the many questions that every newcomer has, participants are assigned someone to help them. Janling is a good friend to me. She's like a godmother and a big help in solving daily problems. I had more or less the same experiences when I came to Germany. It was all foreign to me, and all I'd learnt was the language. The idea for the program came about here, at the Metzler Banking House in the middle of Frankfurt's financial district. The bank has been around since 1674, and it is still in family hands. Today, it's headed by Friedrich von Metzler in the 11th generation. And just like his ancestors, he's keen to take on social responsibility. The scholarship program is part of this. This is practical European help for young people. They gain professional experience. They're no longer just graduates. They can go on to help their countries later, either by working there or by working here. Von Metzler is always looking for more sponsors. A scholarship costs 10,000 euros. There are 17 people in the second year's group. Almost all graduates of the first year's group found employment in Germany. That's what these young people want, too. In the beginning, I want to work, and then maybe start on a master's degree. This scholarship has another three months to go. Then the young graduates can start their working lives. The new applicants are waiting in the wings. The next scholarship program starts in the autumn.